What's up, lock family? This is Mac, and I'm back giving you a 19 month lock update. Some updates about my last video from my last video when I um start sharing about me using this Neo Cell collagen. How I started using it for health reason, but one of the benefits that I started to really notice was that my hair had grown extremely fast, and also my nails and improvement in my skin and since then when i um i had been using it before i was using it once a day but i had started using it as a collagen loading and which the collagen loading and you do it for about 30 days but initially before that i was only using it once a day and because i started having problems with my neck i started doing the collagen loading and my hair just started growing just really, really started growing and so did my nails. But I only had like a half a bottle at the time. And so I purchased a new um, type of collagen that I, I want to show you. I'm going to, I guess, maybe post a picture of the things that I've been using. And so I want to give you an update on that and just kind of show you some things that's going on. I decided to do something to implement something um different today and we're going to see how that's going so far it's going pretty good but we will see so um today i started doing and misting my hair with infusion fusium and uh half infusium which is a leave-in conditioner and i use almond oil and jojoba oil and the jojoba oil is for moisture because I started noticing that my hair is really, 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 um, is really dry. And so we're going to see how that works. I was using before then, I was using this right here, the rose water and glycerin. And this is like $8 and I have to ride like 30 minutes to, to get it. And this little bottle doesn't last me that long. I was filling it with... Um, half half and i was just putting it on my scalp and it, it worked pretty good but i'm still experiencing a lot of dryness and so um i used to be a cosmetologist and i what would always work for my type of hair was leave-in conditioner and so i would do leave-in conditioner and put some oil in it and so i decided that i was going to try because this stuff is so expensive i was going to try something that i um thought might work which is the leave-in conditioner we're gonna see how this works y'all but it's a leave-in conditioner it's in um fusium and it has a lot of b vitamins a lot of amino acids and things that help you you know protect your hair if you've had damage to your hair <clears throat> and so what i used to do when my hair was um natural was to whenever I would shampoo my hair and then just maintain it because my hair would always be really really dry and fuzzy I would spray it half and half of water and the leave-in conditioner and maybe put a little bit of oil in it so I said let me see how that is because it's liquid it's liquid and so what I did today was I did half the infusium is infusium 23 and I put um maybe like a fourth of this which is silk elements um sweet almond oil and then another fourth of this which is jojoba oil and I mix it up in here and I shook it up and I just put it all over in in my different um my different partings in my hair and I can notice we're going to see long term I put it on my skin first because I don't want stuff just sitting on top of my hair I want to see if it would absorb and um it, it did pretty good it's not oily and you could tell it has a little bit of moisture in it and so I did that and I'll give you guys some update about that a little bit later in my last video I was supposed to have um hair maintenance done but we end up having an issue in the family my granddaughter decided that she was going to climb up a closet my uh, two-year-old granddaughter um decided she was going to climb up a closet and she got her foot hung in one of the little pockets the little shoe pockets and she broke her leg and so we had to cancel that appointment and i haven't made another one so 
Um, needless to say, I guess I'm semi-free forming because I hadn't had a retwist in months since about April. I would try to wrap and twist a little bit, but I'm not in all all of that. So, but anyway, um, that's something new that I'm gonna try to see how that works. You know how it works out. Um, it has B vitamins in it. It's supposed to be like 23 different vitamins. Um, it has a very very strong. I don't want to say it's, it's stronger than rose water, kind of like perfumey smell, which might be good. But then again, I'm not sure. So I may the next time maybe do half water or something to kind of tone down the scent. Um, but it's a leave-in treatment, leave-in conditioner. It has 23 different um, pro-vitamins, B5 complex vitamins, um, a lot of amino acids. So I'm going to try that. Okay, so what I'm going to... Um, show you my hair is still growing my skin is doing well my nails are doing well but opposed to the neo cell i decided to try dr axe multi-collagen um because i only had like a half a bottle of the neo cell and then i wanted to try something because this has type one two three five and ten where the other one i think only had like one two and three and maybe I don't know if it had three or not. I don't have the bottle, so I don't I don't really know. But anyway, um, this is multi, um, you know, collagen. And so that's Dr. Axe is ancient nutri nutrients, multi-collagen protein. And so I've, um, I'm trying to think within a couple of days by the 7th of December, I will have to go back to using the regular, um, I guess the regular amount of collagen, which is once a day, but that uh, is a 30 day collagen load, man. And I mean, it really has helped. I haven't had any problems with, with joint pain or my neck pain. And I put it, you know, ask several of my friends, I'm in school as a health coach to try doing the collagen load with me as well to kind of just see, you know, how it worked for them. And um, one of my friends, he has arthritis and he said he can tell a major, major difference. My sister's trying it, but she's only been on it about a, um, a week or so. And my, my friend, like I said, he's trying the Neo Cell Collagen. And so, but anyway, let's get some updates about my hair. Um, any difference that I do see it is still growing. Um, it's not as dry, but I've only used that today. As far as the the moisture, the hoba oil for moisture, um, my ends are kind of coming together. Still not as frizzy as what it had been, but um. Oh, let's see. So you can see some of the growth because it's still growing, and it's a difference, man. I'm telling you, within just that little time that I was doing the um. Can you see? Let me take you around. And you can tell I haven't had any retwist. I probably need to pull my hair apart. But um it's it's growing. It's growing, it's growing, it's growing. I have not been pulling my hair back. It's not that for some reason is it's is I guess because of the perimeter of my head is is growing longer, of course, in the back because it, you know. The nape of your neck, your hair is going to hang a little bit lower. Um, but this still, like I might can put it back a little bit, but I'd be glad when I can put it up because it's starting to get in my face and get on my glasses and gets all greasy. But anyway, I would advise and, you know, to, you know, if you are wanting your hair to grow, you're just wanting your skin to improve, try this collagen. Try this collagen loading and see how it, um, it works for your hair and your skin. Um, look up Dr. Axe. Um, collagen loading and if you try it let me know how it works for you I've had a couple people they ask me like girl what are you doing with your skin because your skin looks so good and that your hair your hair is growing and um I'm like okay you know I've been doing the collagen loading it's been working pretty good also I take biotin I do that me being vegan or more majority of plant plant-based um a lot of times if you're, you you don't know, eat meat, you have problems with your B vitamins, lacking in B vitamins. And so I take um, biotin and B complex every day as well. 
that could kind of be contributing to the hair growth because B vitamins are very, very good for your hair. In fact, in this leave-in conditioner in here, most of all the, the vitamins in there are B vitamins. Um, but uh, it's really, really helping. I do something a little bit later to see how this little mixture that I've created, I've looked up, I haven't seen or heard anybody using the leave-in conditioner, um, infusing them leave-in conditioner for their locks. So I decided to do that because one is it's um, accessible for me. I don't want to keep spinning because I go through this a lot, which is, it's, it's okay. Actually, rosemary work, water works better for my hair, but it takes so much to try to steep it and whatever it was fresh rosemary. But um, this smell though right now is kind of strong. It's kind of giving me a little headache because it is so strong. Um, I might have to tone that down, but anyway... If you've had any experience using it or if you know of a better collagen or some other advice that you can give, man, I'm open. Let's make some dialogue. Um, had a couple people to ask me about it that we make connections on YouTube and uh, we follow each other. But um, anyway, I hope that helped. Um, I may just upload this and then come up maybe next month and kind of let you know what's going on with my hair my, my 20th month. I'm almost coming up on two years. Okay, but anyway, guys, wanted to give you a quick update. Take it easy.